Hi my cars! Welcome back to my YouTube channel and for today's video, I'll be showing you guys these awesome heatless curls using pegs. In case you didn't know, pegs are tiny tools we often use to hang our clothes to dry but I had this awesome idea of hanging slash tying my hair instead. It's super easy to do and all you need is your comb and these babies. Start by sectioning your hair into two equal parts and tie up the part that you will work with later. After that, go ahead and brush out your hair so that there are no tangles. Now take a tiny section of your hair and brush through it with your comb. As always, I use my favorite tangle teaser. Then take a peg, press it open, insert your hair and begin tying it around the peg. Once all of your hair is tied, go ahead and release the peg. Make sure your hair is 50-60% to 60 damp, so this is best done after a shower. You can also use a water spray bottle if your hair is dry and don't have time to wash your hair. Now do these exact same steps for all the sections that you take. Please make sure your pegs are large sized if you have long hair like me, but if you have shorter length then go ahead with medium or even small pegs if you got shoulder length hair. Keep a glass of water near you in case you get tired from all this exercise. At least for me it is. And then once you're done with that side of the hair, feel proud because you've made it. Now it's time to work on the other part of your hair and do the same steps all over again. I'm also subdividing that part to make it more easier for me. Same thing, take a section of your hair, open the peg, tie your hair around it and release. Once you're done, keep the pegs for at least 2 hours and then you can remove them as I will show you in a bit. Now it's time for the reveal! Finally! Okay, so now it's been more than 2 hours and I've already done my makeup and now I'm super super curious to see what is the results. I have used pegs for heatless curls before, once when I went out and once I had done a video for Instagram. Both times it was very loose and this time it is like a little bit more tight. So fingers crossed, I think the results are gonna be better than before. Let's start with this pink one. Oh wait, I should apply a spray first. This is the Silhouette Swash Cough. This is what my parents, not my parents, this is what my dad and my brother use for their beards as they are sick as well. Let's try this. <coughs> that should do it. Alright, so I'm gonna wait for like five more minutes. Okay, so I'm gonna do now. Ow. Oh my god, look at that! Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Look at that. One problem with these pegs is that they keep getting stuck. My hair keeps getting stuck. Amazing, it's worth it you guys. The entire process is worth it. Especially because you don't apply any heat to your hair. So you're not damaging your hair. Look at that you guys. So, so, so gorgeous. I am in love. Especially because I have long hair. This has like ridiculously reduced the amount of my hair. From from my thighs to here. Like I always wanted waist lengthed hair and now I have it. Oh what happened here? Look at that, that's not a proper curl. I think because I have too much hair. It's harder for me to do it with the pegs, but I would prefer it more than the curling irons. One more left, I guess. Yes, finished. Yeah! Oh! Many people open the curls with the brush. I don't want to do that. I think 
I'm gonna keep it this way. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, then press the thumbs up button. It helps grow my channel. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram where I post way more videos than I do over here. The name is over here and Snapchat is also over here. So till then, take care and see you guys next time. Bye.